Hey guys, welcome back to the channel in winter. Winter Wonderland. Yeah. If you could call it that. It's here and it's here it's to been stay. It's snowing all week. It has been. It's like we're in a snow globe. Yeah. For sure. I just want to show you in this video because I got a lot of calls in the last couple of days. Um, I don't want to switch this over to Total Primrose, but I want you guys to know you, not only do we want to show you stuff we do on trucks, but how we maintain our trucks. Mm -hmm. And the amount of calls I have received with fuel issues in the last couple of days has been crazy. So we'll just show them a little bit what we use and kind yeah. of some pictures. Yeah. We're not we're not salespeople, but no. uh, this is what we do in, in our trucks. Exactly. And I don't think I've ever got a call of fuel filter issues, really. No, Chad. Not, not any of ours. To be honest with you, Chad goes probably, I'm going to say 80 to 100,000 before he changes fuel yeah, filters. It yeah. still drives me crazy, but. Yeah, I know. I do that <laughs> just to drive you nuts. I know. <laughs> but so. no, I honestly like, we just, we run our fuel filters out. We run off for restriction gauges. Restriction gauges don't lie, but I mean, okay. At 100,000, it's like, okay, it's time. We just change the filters. Yeah. But we don't have issues. That's true. So. All right. Well, we're going to go inside where it's a little bit warmer show you this primrose stuff show you what people are calling on and maybe we can just help you out with this in yep. the future all right let's do it what do we all got right. going on here see these filters can you see that this on the filter is what a lot of us say is gelled up we're gelled up we have issues i actually have a filter that i keep in the freezer here um you can, un you can unscrew see. that and take it out well it's they hard can to probably do. see it better but right here you can see it um that's an actual filter that has what's in the picture of the paper yep and so, that that the reason we put it in the freezer is just to preserve it that filter is three years old i think it's two years old two years old two years old so that is the same as what this is the white on the filter yep. that's called carboxylate it's a drag and, reducing agent that they put in the pipeline that you can have up to 82 degrees 82 degrees it'll actually go back into liquid form Correct. is what she's saying so with that being said now that it's getting cold and everyone's calling that they're having these issues this is the carboxyl it's acting up it, you will see it more when it gets colder if it if it's gelled it'll go back into liquid form about 32 degrees that don't go back into liquid form right. until 82 so right. it's not gelling that's carboxylate. It's that's carboxylate. what she's trying this to say. This is 90 some percent of what we're going to see for an issue. Will you see an actual froze up fuel? I've seen one in my time frame, well, but yeah. it happens. I get it. But this is your problem. So that's why we use the Power Cleanse from Primrose. Power Cleanse is the only product that out of all the testing and playing that I've done similar to the um, video I showed the other day of the phaser. This is the only stuff I've seen that if I put this filter, and I did, I filled some cleanse in a tote, set a filter with this in there, and it'll disperse it out evenly. I have tried many other products. I've tried Power Service, Penray, Howes, any of them, and it would not touch this carboxylate. And we're, we're not, not saying that, to, yeah, exactly. I'm not bashing any other product. I'm just telling you this is what's worked for us because you can use whatever you so choose. But this, has taken care of that problem. This has taken care of it, smooth out the injectors, burns cleaner. Yep. It actually does many more things. It adds 40 points of cetane to your fuel. It'll clean your injectors out, less regens, less death usage. It has multiple uses with it, but come this time of year, it's a huge, yep. huge benefit to have. Um, what else am I missing on it, Chad? Well, <clears throat> a lot of people look at that and, you know, they want to know the cost per mile and all that and what they get back out of it. And the one huge thing is fuel mileage. Mm -hmm. Now, I know, I know this is a, a shocker, but like we don't use it for fuel mileage. We use it for all the extra benefits. Um, our trucks run Northwest. We don't want fuel issues, and we don't have fuel issues. Our new purple truck doesn't even have fuel heaters on it. It doesn't bother me whatsoever. Which reminds me when you say that, too. We, Like you said, we run Northwest. This is their summer blend product. They do have a winter product, too. But if you're getting a winter blended fuel at the pump, it's already treated. 
So yep. we use this every fill up that we get fuel year round. Year round, and year we round. have not had issues. We have it's, ran this. We have trucks running out to Oregon, Washington, through the mm -hmm. Dakotas. We just don't have issues. But so, if you think about it, we run year round. We're being proactive. Yeah. We don't. We don't. We don't have injector failures. We don't. I mean, not to say we ever would, because when a mechanical part fails, it fails. There's not much you can do about it yeah. if it's a faulty part. But for the most part. We don't have fuel issues, and and that right there, that's the reason why. Exactly. So, but just wanted to throw that tidbit out because I'm getting a lot of calls. Wanted to show some people this, and I can at least send some of you to the videos when you do call. So, if it's something you're interested in, like I said, I don't want this to sound like a sales pitch, but it is on our website www.berrytrucking.com. It is Power Cleanse 5007. It has yeah. worked great for us. I know there's a lot of other people out there that are using it and feel the same way. So. And now that it's Hopefully cold out, it's just, it's, it's time to, to make sure everybody else is prepared. Exactly. We, we care. We really do. It's not about the sale. It's about not being stuck on the side of the road. Yeah. Just another thing that we're teaching, just same as when you do the <clears throat> work Correct. in the shop. So. Correct. All right, guys. Thanks. Hope that helps you out. And I hate to see or hear any of you on the side of the road. So if this can prevent it, by all means, let's try it.